So you guys like action, epic moments, or even fights taking place because you need something constantly going on when watching anime? Well, you're in luck, because I'm here to save you all with the best upcoming action anime you need to watch. Now most of these anime will be airing next year in 2025, so definitely you are in the right place to get the best recommendations possible. I really hope you all enjoy the video. Starting things off with I may be a guild receptionist, but I'll solo any boss. A whole new looking action packed anime of an average looking girl who took the easy way of wanting a simple life of being a guild receptionist since it's not even that hard of a job. However, when complaints kept piling up of tough dungeons that adventurers really struggled to beat, the paperwork kept going up and there was only one thing that she could do to save herself. Beat the dungeon herself and destroy the boss on her own to save her time from all the hassle. Of course, she also wants to keep this power of hers a secret so she doesn't get the attention. Now this here is what I'm talking about boys and girls, an anime original created by Studio Shaft. You don't want to miss out on this. Their new anime called Virgin Punk, the story of a girl named Ubu who lives the danger and chaotic life and she only wants the powerful and eccentric individuals around her while all the other weaklings get punished or are even gotten rid of. She's a bounty hunter, fierce, dangerous, and she absolutely looks gorgeous when in action. I'm super excited for this anime, especially to witness great visuals by the Omega Studio Shaft come into play. We are getting a brand new anime of a powerful demon hunter or slayer who was once a shrine guardian or a complete stranger to now traveling through time, slaying countless demons in an epic visually stunning piece created by Yokohama Animation. Simply take it as a samurai anime, a demon hunter with time traveling and lots of action. What's not to love about this, honestly? It just sounds epic and I really can't wait to witness it when it begins airing in 2025. Now hear me out on this, but when I first saw this trailer, I thought it was someone related to Jobless Reincarnation due to how similar the protagonist looks to Paul. Now this is a story of a humble old man who is a sword instructor living in a rural village in his own dojo. An old pupil of his from years ago invited him for an important task, and that is for him to become an instructor to the Knights of the Liberian Order. But now the guy is more occupied than before and even meets his old former pupils, some which are so highly ranked, they couldn't possibly meet their old instructor again, do they? Unless, of course, an interesting twist was to take place. <laughs> Well, need I say anything to what this anime is about besides it being another one of those banished from the hero's party? But after being mistreated as a handyman all the time, UK left the A rank party and got fed up with being treated as a scum doing chores all the time. But fate was on his side because later on, he was then welcomed to an all girls female party, which means he got himself a harem. And his true powers are revealed to an extraordinary, you know, because he has insane magic and skill with all his arsenal. Sounds very generic, but hey. Even generic is sometimes something that I'd be watching anytime. Ubelblad is an upcoming action anime that looks and sounds really badass. Rumor has it that a powerful being wields a dark blade and anyone who stands in its way will be shredded completely. Now the boy has extraordinary sword skills, yet is being hunted down by four powerful warriors prepared to take him down. And those warriors were said to be defeated long ago, but now the young swordsman will have his abilities tested to the limits. This anime 
Kirby probably has the most insane or unique twist I've ever seen in a while, but basically, the worst of the worst criminals usually are sentenced to death for all the bad things that they did. But this time, they will be sentenced to heroism, to fight against the Demon Lord's army in the front line as punishment. This anime is called Sentenced to be a Hero. It's quite strange of an outcome, but it kind of excites me to see how things will be played out. But anyway, I mean, you know, how can being a hero be punishment unless there's more to what we all thought of? This is a pretty cool action anime of two clans who see things differently and battle against one another. <laughs> But we have a protagonist, a high schooler named Cheeky, who gets expelled from school due to his reckless behavior and mean behavior. And he was under the care of his foster father, who is secretly from the Momotaru clan, who was hiding Shiki and keeping him safe. But that is until the Momotaru members came barging in looking for Shiki and ended up killing his foster father. But it was then later revealed that Shiki is a powerful Oni, which his powers were kept as a secret. But now that his foster father is gone, it is time to seek revenge on the Momotaru people who killed his family. Sakamoto Days! Man, this is an anime I'm really gonna enjoy watching because it is simply going to be not only funny, but very entertaining. Sakamoto used to be the greatest hitman alive, the most feared man in the underground world who decides to get married to a lovely woman he fell in love for, which made him completely retire from his job. Now he looks like an older fat man who has a family and a new job as a convenience store clerk. However, former enemies of his still have a score to settle with him, but, you know, they want to do what they can to bring Sakamoto down. And my boy has to do everything he can to protect his family using his epic hitman skills that he still has in his bag. Finally, I'm here to recommend the last anime in today's video list, Solo Leveling Season 2, Arise from the Shadow the most hype show airing at the start of 2025 in the winter season, which will continue Song Jin Woo's journey after obtaining his new power when awakening the knights from the dead. Now, I'm pretty sure you all know what he is now. Seriously though, looking at the, you know, just looking at the new trailer, it just gets me really excited, and I really can't wait to see this and, you know, just overall witness the growth of one of the best anime protagonists I have ever laid my eyes on. This is where we come to a full stop. The end of the list, but more to come very soon, so do stay tuned. But thank you all so much for watching to the end of the video of great action recommendations. Drop a like and subscribe to stay notified of my latest uploads, and I'll be seeing you all in the next one.